Great Lakes Stainless was founded right around 30 years ago. We have a, a quite a diverse set of processes that we do here. Um, typical sheet metal work uh, is a huge part of it. We have fiber laser cutters, we have CNC brake presses, we have panel benders, plate rolls, some light machining capacity. We specialize in TIG welding, typically light gauges, 12 to 20 gauge, with one of our largest is 18 gauge. For the project that we have the robot for and the laser welder, it was a new customer for us uh, with a fairly complicated um, product line that they had. A lot of curved uh, stainless that needed to be grinded and polished that's right in our wheelhouse, um, but at a really consistent, pretty high volume. They were looking for a fabricator to uh, specialize in their stainless work in their escalator line. We TIG welded every single part. We had a laser welder, um, which we're using occasionally, but really weren't able to get the results we needed until we added the FANUC GoBot with the welder, integrated it along with uh, Sarah Laser. Sarah Laser was reselling the light weld from IPG. We then um, worked with them to incorporate our technology, uh, providing that seamless integration of the light weld to the FANUC CRX. The benefit of the CRX is that they can take the I wouldn't say as much repetitive, but more of a continuous operation and produce a high quality path. Our goals for the program with the robot and the laser welder really were to uh, expand our capacity, keep up with the volume of the customer, and of course part of that is reducing the cycle time. Before the automation, uh, warpage was a big issue. We found out that the cobot was able to put just enough penetration into the part, but also decrease the amount of heat that's needed. And so that uh, decreased the amount of warpage. And so we had fewer nonconformities and that helped increase um, productivity, time, and manufacturability. We went from probably a total of around three hours, including setup and welding, um, to probably around 15 minutes. And we've never had a cobot before. We never had any experience with it. And overall, it's been extremely positive. Between the integration um, that Sarah put together and the performance of the FANUC robot uh, has been great. The CRX has many advantages over manual welding. And especially when used with a wire feed control system gives you excellent results. The tablet's pretty user-friendly, makes it simpler. Cobot's easy to use. It's less dirty, you know, it's a cleaner environment. The automation has really allowed us to free up very skilled operators uh, for honestly more interesting, varied and complex projects that we do that they are really interested in doing. It's streamlined our process, and so that's huge in manufacturing, and when you have that, you're able to increase your output of not only parts, but um, allocation of time. We are currently under contract for another FANUC robot for the grinding and polishing process. I don't know how better to advocate for the success of a project than diving straight into a second phase of it and expansion of it.